Aquaba, 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 a two. I personally thought that was a good intro. My brothers, they weren't really feeling it. So if you're feeling that, please let me know. If you weren't, also let me know. And then um, I'll still go with what I feel at the end of the day, but let me know regardless. So this is gonna be a very interesting video purely because I have no idea how it's gonna go. I have no idea if I'll actually upload this video. And if you're watching it now, well, I also went through, hashtag clutch man. Anyway, today I'll be going to Leeds to pick up a pair of shoes I won in a raffle. Shout out to Size Leeds who were selecting me for the raffle. So I'm so grateful to those guys. And I thought, oh sick, I'll probably vlog this. Then I thought, oh, that's a bit awkward, I probably won't vlog it. And then I thought, you know what, I'll push myself out of my comfort zone and see how that feels for a bit. And then obviously I went through, I can't really tell you how it went because obviously I'm not being yet, but that's the plan for today. I'll give a quick prediction how I think it will go. I think I'll probably come through clutch, hashtag clutch man. It probably will feel a bit awkward, but I'll definitely try to push myself out of comfort zone. And I've got you people to hold me accountable for that. So yeah, this is today's vlog. I hope you enjoy it and I'll give you a debrief of the shoes when I get them. And obviously I'll give you my opinion of how I found it today vlogging in public for the first time. See ya. Just about made the train. Slow and hot. My ears sweating for no reason. Shit my head. Can you imagine? <laughs> anyway, these here we come. So anyway, just arrived in Leeds. I was actually going to film myself here. Purely because it's kind of awkward, but I realised the guy was looking at me, so I had to make myself look as if I was doing something interesting. So yeah, just arrived, walking over to the size store. Hopefully it's going to be a sick uh, experience. I say experience, I'm not really experiencing anything. But yeah, hopefully the guys will be cool with me filming, and we'll see how it runs. See you in a bizzle. Yeah, this ain't it, man. This ain't the one. This ain't the one. Anyway, let's keep moving. I'm actually feeling very, very shy. You know. Yeah, I'm not gonna cap. This thing is really, really kind of awkward. I'm not enjoying it at all. I feel very, very uncomfortable. And the only reason I'm doing it now is because I find a really nice quiet spot for literally nobody here. Even my man just looks at me like I'm a weirdo, but I don't care. We move. spare before my train arrived so I decided to go to an Italian restaurant to see what they could offer me. Is it just you? Is it just you? Yeah no I'll finish. I crossed that anyway. Oh okay. Yes. Do I need to take off my mask? No, no, I don't know. Can I wait? Yeah you take off. Thank you. So then nobody else knows. Yeah. Where are you from? Where are you from? You know exactly where he's from. You're out here trying to flex your Italian small, small. Shit, my head. Where are you from? Sicily, Italy. Sicilia? Sicilia, yeah. Ti piaci? I've been, eh? Ti piaci? Oh. Oh, do you speak Italian or no? Ti piace? Si. Yeah. Ti piace, cosa? I've been here 45 years. Oh, okay. Ma perché vieni qui? Because my father, my hermano, my father, started here. Oh. So I'm going to go. Ah, va bene, va bene. I have a family here. 
la moglie inglese oh, okay. adesso mia moglie inglese ho molti figli Bagliare un poco? Io? Eh. Sì, sì. I figli? Ho sei figli qua. Sei? Sei. Mamma mia. E di cose sette. Davvero? Oh, mamma mia. Big family. Perché ti piace grande famiglia? Io yeah, mi piace la famiglia, i bambini vengono, vengono. Fai l'amore con la moglie? Ah, esatto, esatto. Vieno? Una. Una. <ride> eh, Tua moglie... Ehm... Eh, sì. Parla italiano? Un po', un po', sì, sì. Ho voluto andare in Italia questo anno, ma perché questa sezione non ma, posso? Eh, eh, come si chiama? Però la vedo, però la vedo, non lo dico. Esatto. Non è buono per niente, non è buono. Per viaggiare non è buono. Eh. Esatto. Io penso che in Italia, anche, anche chi va in Italia, viene qui, mm. deve fare due settimane di la garanzia, la garanzia, la garanzia, la garanzia, la garanzia, sì, sì. non ce n'è covid, non ce n'è covid, non c'è niente, in che senso non c'è niente, non signor? niente, è finito tutto, a Palermo non abbiamo niente, dov'è il mio questo? Non è buono, due settimane fai qua, stai qua senza fare niente, <ride> vacanza lì, in Italia vacanza qui, esatto, esatto, <ride> Ma probabilmente la prossima anno mi vado. Yeah, yeah, meglio, sta meglio. Il prossimo anno sta Spero, meglio. Sì. Quest'anno per sei mesi, per questi sei mesi io penso mm. di parlare per sei mesi. Dopo Pasqua, forse dopo Pasqua. Anche tua mo moglie ancora lavora? Non lavora qui la mia moglie. Qui? Sì. Con... Ah, okay. sì, Ho già finito? Hai ha, ha già finito? Ha già ha lavorato, ha lavorato oggi? Sì, yeah, oggi ha okay. lavorato, l'ha lasciato prima, l'ha lasciato presto lei. Eh. Oh, ok. È andato, è andato con mio figlio. Ok. È andato fuori con mio figlio, è andato a casa, a casa di mio figlio. Ah, oh, ok. Uno, uno di questo. Il primo. Okay. Il secondo, anzi, il secondo. Oh, ok. Mi dispiace, come si chiama? Eh? Come si chiama? Io. Mimmo Mimmo Domenico, mi scambio fra un Domenico Oh, ok, Mimmo yeah. Yeah. Bene. Bene. Grazie mille La prossima volta no? Sì Ci vediamo la prossima volta no? Ci vediamo dopo yeah. Grazie ciao, mille ciao. A piacere Ciao That was cool. You can see I'm back home now after my trip to Leeds. Oh. Um, let's do the unboxing first and we'll get into my thoughts of today's trip. Here they are themselves. I ask Havana's. What do you guys think? I think I did really it's outdone themselves, but this is a really solid pair. So this is part of the collection of six. So 10 years ago, 2010, they released six shoes, part of the City Series um, collection. There was the Londons, Cardiffs, Birmingham's, Dublin's, Manchester, and Glasgow's. <laughs> How ironic, the Glasgow. So 10 years on, they've decided to do a reverse of that and do their twin cities of the six cities. So, so far, I've had Liverpool with Dublin, We've had Manchester with Cordoba, had London and Shanghai, and now for the fourth, we've got Havana and Glasgow. Shout out to all my um, Glasgow people. I literally have one friend from Glasgow, and she's not even from Glasgow, she's from here. Anyway, <laughs> you can see one of 2200. First of all, it's one of 2020. Get it right at least. I think it's a great pair. Really cool. Nicely, we've got alternative There's laces. You can see the originals, navy color of the Glasgow's. And then we've got the pinks of Havana's as well. And on the aglets, hope you can see that. It says Havana. The box itself, if you flip it, you can get the Glasgow interior, which I think is really kind of cool. 
And yeah, very solid pair, I tried them on earlier, comfortable, just sick. Um, if I get the guards, I'm sure to make a video of that. And um, yeah, these are the Adidas Savannahs. Comment down below what you think of them. I'm a personally big fan, talking about the rest of you too. Oh snap, I almost forgot. I give you a little book as well. In the book slash magazine, how do you want to call it? It goes through the shoe, the idea of the shoe, where it came from, the influence of Havana, and we realized that it's not actually Havana in Cuba, but it's Little Havana in America, Miami. And we see parts of the community, the locals, the culture, the flavor of the whole city. So yeah, back to the video. How did I find it today? Definitely was nowhere near as close as I thought it was gonna be, which was, it wasn't surprising. It was just, you know, it is what it is. What it is what it is. It is, it is what it is. it is. I think I'll definitely give it a go again. I think it's good that it's something that, you know, it's uh, pushing outside my comfort zone, which would be good to finally get used to it. So you guys are gonna be able to see the progress of me feeling uncomfortable, to being very comfortable. When that day comes, I'm sure we'll, we'll have to wait and see. But like I said, the, the vlog was unexpected. You saw me go to Leeds, you saw me chilling, you saw me doing vibes. We broke down a little bit of Italian vegan tops and then, um, yeah, I think I'll end the video. Wait, wait, before we finish the video, I forgot to tell you a little story that happened in Leeds today. So I was walking down after getting the shoes and I walked past this lady. You know those types of people who try to sell you stuff or speak to you in town or whatever? And I walked past her and she said, oh, do you have, can I ask you a question? And I just walked past and I was like, um, sorry. I kept on walking. I thought to myself, hold on a second. She just wanted to ask me a question. Why am I walking away like I was busy? I wasn't doing anything. I just got, I literally had an hour spare or something after getting the shoes because my train was delayed. I remember the episode with um, Ellie, shout out to Talking Twenties. We were talking about um, homeless people and how people just walk past them in the streets and avoid them. Obviously this lady wasn't homeless. But it was pretty much the same scenario of people just walking past them and she just wanted to ask a question. So I reversed myself, went back and said, I'm so sorry about that. Um, sure, what was your question? And then she said to me, she said, you're the first person in about seven years who's done that, who's uh, gone past me, ignored me and come back and spoken to me. So um, I really appreciate that. And then we just started talking about what she does. And I was too young for what she wanted to do. I think it was all about mental health and awareness and things like that. But that's just something for you today. Don't avoid the people who have questions for you. Try and, if you do have time, speak to them and, you know, make the day like I happen to meet the ladies, so. Yeah, anyway, back to the video, back to the end. If you guys liked it, please make sure to like, subscribe, comment, uh, share it with your friends, family, your enemies, let them all know about this vlog and these videos. And um, yeah, I'll see you guys next time, next week. Peace.